Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, seven, seven, nine. Ravens fam. So, Steve Young was preaching. Um, for those of you that haven't seen a video already, I know a lot of you have already. You, you had to, you know what I'm saying? But uh, here's the clip. Robert, you set me up perfectly because the Baltimore Ravens have doubled down again on being the most un being the most sophisticated running game in football, and they have been mowing through regular season opponents for a long time with this most sophisticated running game. My position is they will never get to championship football without a sophisticated passing game. That's not anything to do with Lamar Jackson. Lamar Jackson is a complete player that is being not trained in being a sophisticated passer. They doubled down again back to all the great things that Lamar does. Great. But until he gets the chance to show that he is a sophisticated passer of the football in a sophisticated passing game that is properly you know, invested in, which we never have, which they never have done to Robert's point just a minute ago. They don't invest in it. They don't teach it. And now you ask them, why isn't he getting paid to be Patrick Mahomes? Because they haven't given him a chance to be Patrick Mahomes. So until they do, Lamar Jackson's damned because of what the Ravens are doing, not because of Lamar Jackson. I can't wait for someone to train Lamar Jackson in a sophisticated passing game. I think he'd be the greatest player in the history of the game. Yeah. But he keeps getting, he's being held back by the Ravens year after year because they keep doubling down to this thing that Lamar Jackson is great at. No question. He's, he's the best at that. Yeah. But it's not the championship football that they need to play, and it's not where Lamar Jackson wants to be. I want the full measure, Robert, of yeah. who Lamar Jackson is. And the full measure is not being brought forward by the Ravens. And if that's not the case, then get out and find someone who will. Okay, so I'm just quick, 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 quick pointers. Um... He said Lamar Jackson can be the greatest, you know, we have seen. I 100% agree. Um, because they really haven't given him a chance to really just throw that thing. So, we, a lot of us working fans, we believe he can do that. And we, we know about the vault, quotations, the vault, Greg Roman's vault. Um, but... We know he got the he has the run, you know, and I'm like, okay, Greg Romans, you know, little run plays and all that. It's like Lamar can be spectacular without that, you know. He he didn't winning the Heisman is not easy. I know that was college and everything, but that's not easy. Okay, then um, you know they uh. He mentioned something pretty much like uh, the Ravens run game. Uh, they're, they're stuck on their run game. And I believe that's Greg Roman. I believe that's Harbs. I believe this upper management for us that. And the thing I have a, a slight problem with that run game is, in my opinion, it's, it's my, if, if, if I'm incorrect, let me know, okay? 2000 Ravens won the Super Bowl. We know that was the defense. 2012. Um, we know, you know, Flacco won the MVP for as the Super Bowl. But I I really remember in those playoffs, um, I remember seeing Bowden ball out. Uh you know, I don't. I, Ray Rice did his thing, but that wasn't that main. You know, like oh my God, he he, he did that run, and without that run, we would have lost. I remember seeing that with Bowden, the uh, the you know the, the the play everybody remembers, the play everybody remembers, but Jacoby catching that, uh, that 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 wasn't you know a Ray Rice miracle run or something like that. Um, it is just like, I know the Ravens are stuck with that run first mentality and nothing's wrong with that, but I haven't really seen that win this day and age because let me think, um, 
the Bengals passed all over us. Uh, but, you know, there was a lot of injuries and stuff like that. Um, hey, the Super Bowl champions, you know, they, they passed it. OBJ was killing it. Cooper Cup, you know, he did his thing. That was us passing. Um, and really, if you think about it, too, with the rules this day and age, cornerbacks, safeties, they can literally get flagged a lot. You can't even really touch them nowadays. Why not take advantage of that? A lot of these other teams are taking advantage of that. Heck, if you they want to talk about running, look at freaking Derrick Henry. The dude was beast and running. Whooped that butt in 2019 with the run. But when that run was shut down, they were stuck. They were stuck. That was like the Ravens. When that run was stuck, shut down, they were stuck. Let Lamar do his thing. Let the man flourish. Let him bloom. I do believe the Ravens are holding him back. But they are also is helping him for us offensive line. We know we got the um the young wide receivers. I'm up and down for as adding a veteran. Y'all already know my opinion. I believe giving them a chance. If you decide OBJ, I would be happy with that. Because he, we would know he'd come on later in in the year, young bucks, they can do their thing, prove themselves. But um, then the passing scheme, that's, they say, they didn't say it for a couple of years now that, you know, the vault, it's, it's not believable, you know, it's really not. It's just like, okay, Greg Roman. You had your excuse last year not to get fired like like Wink did, you know. Um, but, like, it's time to show up now, man. I would like for us to win a Super Bowl with that style, but I don't see it happening. I would love to be wrong about that. But, it's played out. I still have that Steve Smith video in my head about what he said if you don't remember here's the clip and he will surprise you early on but in the end as defensive coordinators start to get all of the information think about it he's been running the same stuff for eight years now he changes the jersey but the same plays are going over and over he has better players 2012 Look at this, 22 personnel, two running backs, two tight ends, one wide receiver. That wide receiver is also Randy Moss. Anyway, 2015, Tyrod Taylor, 22 personnel, same look, same formation. Hmm, let's go to 2020, folks. Ah, wow. Same formation, same thing. If he doesn't change it up, Lamar will still start to look less Lamar. So it's not Lamar needs to change it up. Greg Roman needs to update his database. His he got viral. But we remember that. We we remember what Steve said. We remember that. And yeah, it's true. Yeah, you can have the same formation, different different teams, but yeah, just that that one wide receiver, you know. I don't know. It happened one time. They double up on it. Twenty nineteen. That's what I'm like. It's it's thin. They double up on it. I don't know. It's hard to repeat things like that because teams study that. They showing everybody are doubling up on that twenty nineteen. You know, fourteen and two. Teams are gonna remember that. But I don't know. Y'all tell me what y'all think. Hit that like. Hit that subscribe. Hit that share. Everybody stay safe. And shout out to Steve Young, by the way. I, because I believe Lamar can be the goats of goats. He can run. He can pass. He can do it all. But shout out.